And of course, we do that. Um, there are many, many, many questions because even I have read the book and I know that there are many things which are coming up in my mind. And, but still, I would like to be very invasive in this question. It's like, you know, when you were writing this book, were you thinking of some students whom you have trained, some episodes in your life, or something which is like, you know, the Eureka moment that, oh my God, where is this thought coming from? Um, if you read the book, uh, it's not in, uh, you know, a typical author written book, because I'm really not a typical author. Uh, it comes with a very simple language, the language that I speak. So you will also see a lot of uh, Hindi movie uh, quotes, you will also see uh, Sanskrit shlokes, and that's the language that I speak. And so when you read, you will feel, uh, you know, Masu is actually sitting across and uh, talking. And everything that I have written is, uh, I have experienced, uh, I have reflected, I have introspected the stories that are sprinkled all over the book. I love stories and I think we learn a big deal uh, from stories. So there are stories from my life, there are stories from people around me and uh, there are stories uh, from outside world, there are stories from Mahabharata and uh, I think that's the way I generally uh, deal, uh, you know, my training sessions. So I, I don't think this is a typical book, uh, this is actually a workshop uh, because you will have a topic. Uh, I'll go, uh, you know, deep in the topic with a lot of stories, metaphors, and what is it that uh, that is learning, and then I throw some questions for the reader to ponder on, so that they find their own uh, solutions to uh, their own problems. And at end of it, I have given some uh, action plans, so you know, certain tools that you can use and uh, you know, uh, get hang of what I was talking about, or use it for yourself and see the success. And it doesn't end here. I think this is the first book uh, that has a link of guided meditation. Because in my workshops, I generally get uh, you know, uh, the guided meditations done. So they are not typical meditations. They're typically meditations used on a particular topic. If it is talking about uh, you know, past experiences, how do you deal with it? So you know, a meditation which will deal with that. And they're very short, say around 9 to 10 minutes. So you can just, uh, you know, click on um, uh, the link or type the link or you also have a QR code and you can listen to the, uh, you know, YouTube uh, meditation uh, link and that aligns uh, even your subconscious uh, to what you are now getting at. So uh, that's the whole, uh, uh, you know, thing has been. And your question uh, was, uh, does uh, you know the experiences around me involve yes definitely where do i get the fodder from otherwise uh, the books yes there are a lot of references of books because uh, i am because of the books that i read and we all are because of books that we read and uh, i believe humans are also books everybody is a book so uh, whatever i could read uh, i think i have expressed them well read